Khan Khan, Shalawan Shalawan, this is Captain Kadash from Deal Out of Zion. Right now we're in the Fort Myers area, the Lee County area, trying to build our people up. If you send your spirit, we ask that you would send us a $7 cash out to help us build our school and to help us build up the nation of Israel in this area. I want to say Shalawan, hallelujah. Shalom, Shalom. This is Captain Zamar. Hey, make sure y'all follow our Facebook at Lehigh Acres and also make sure you follow our Instagram at DLOZ Lee County. Hallelujah. Shalom, Shalom, Mr. Elder. Make sure you read Acts 20 and 35. And remember to give generously, give generously. Shalom. Shalom. So you grew up in the church, ain't it? Okay. So now, because I'm the same way I grew up in the church or whatever. So now when it comes down to as far as as far as your belief system. In, in in what you how you were raised like do you do you believe in the Bible? As man, we took the disciples, we disciples what we had. All right, we made many denominations. That's a that's a great point, right there. So I'm African American, Native American, European, and Irish. I wasn't right. I didn't ask to be born. Right, right. But right. I made out of love. You said you made a really good point. You said. You said uh, uh, there's many denominations. Yeah, right. 41,000 denominations. I've been 41,000 denominations. But I was, I was like, Mom, she's like, yeah, baby. I'm like, what's up, Baptist, right? She's like, yeah. I'm like, but I'm in Florida, so am I Southern Southerner Baptist? <laughs> she's like, you stupid. I want to say because it has to with no direction. Yeah. Right? Right. It's always going to write. So I mean I think I think the Bible is pretty pretty fundamental in its message, and so you know we get a lot of uh, we get a lot of like we got we got all the different denominations, but the Bible says God is not the author of confusion, and and you know when you look at the different denominations, like for instance you was raised Southern Baptist, correct? Yes, sir. But when you look in the Bible, I don't see any instances of the Bible speaking of be a Southern Baptist, be a Methodist, be a Jehovah's Witness. Those terms aren't in the Bible. The only terms that are in there is believe in him. And also, and again, right? Our lives, like a, a friend just said, uh, right? I'm mean, still with the Salvation Army. Uh -huh. and I was hit by a vehicle on March 6th. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. the mission is not in my hand. Right, exactly. If he, well, because it could, I, I may not have been here right now talking to you. Exactly. Give me Proverbs 24. You know, if, he, I, if he wanted me, well, I'm just saying. And that's a powerful point. That's a powerful point. Let me, let me, can you mind if I read the scripture to you real quick? Proverbs 20, 24. You just said something look, about. Yeah, I'm, look, I'm not going in until I cool down. <laughs> just saying, you getting a little cool sweaty, down. Like, it's going to freeze up, going to be all chapped up. Like, yeah. oh, man. <laughs> Read that. Uh, it's the book of Proverbs, chapter 20, verse 24. Uh -huh. Man's goings are of the Lord. Right. How can a man then understand his own way? Right, so just like we just said, I didn't decide to come here. Right? The Bible just said man's goings are the most high God. a little bit of this talking to each other. Right. That's right. I was made out of love. Well, given everything, right? Right. The power to make life, take life, alter life. Just saying. That's why one individual got a little upset with you know what I'm saying about us. Mm -hmm. you give them all this. What about me? Right. You know who that individual is. Right. Just saying. But it's like okay. A lot um, of people be scared look, to say I that. Came out, look, I came out in this shade. Right. We are shades. We ain't no colors. I agree with blue, that. Orange, right. Yellow, right. Right. We that's a powerful point. In, in each other. Really what we are is, and that's a very powerful point too, we're not colors because that's a social construct. Because when you look at the, the definition of black, it's everything negative. When you look at the definition of white, it's everything positive. The definition but, of black is nothing as what? Right. You're going to say I'm nothing? But in actuality, right. it's everything. Right. right. Hey. So, so, but the Bible doesn't call us black or white, so to speak. It says that we come from different people, right? We come from Jacob. We would be Israelites. And you said you from you said you're African American, right? Native American, European and Irish. But anybody else's eyes, <laughs> uh -huh. I'm still being considered. What what is your father? Uh, Native American and African American. Okay, so and you're being... European and Irish. So that my goes... mother is African American and Native American. Uh, I'm three parts native between the both of them. Okay, then your father's <laughs> Irish? Okay, come on. but do you know what his father was? Or was he Irish as in like from Ireland? Well, yes. Okay, okay. So, uh, still, it's Mississippi living on him, right? Mississippi. I'm learning more about my background. Uh -huh. Right? Right. I just turned 50 in June. Okay. Just saying, I'm, no, I'm learning more now in that, right? Than when I was with my family. 
Right, because there's a whole lot of unknown. You see what I'm saying? I'm just saying, you know. It's like I didn't know that we had a crest. We had what? My family, we have a crest. Oh, a crest? Yes, oh, yeah, so yeah. Just saying, it's like, what? I found that out two years ago. So I, I've noticed that. I've noticed that. I, I work for different offices, and, uh, and uh, like, I work for, work for the Irish doctor, the Scottish doctor, and they have a crest. But, um, like, like, in terms of, like, your mother's side of the family, the scriptures talk about we would lose our identity, right? And so we would be, cons- we would be called these terms, like, black and this and that, Afro-American, African-American. Our, 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 our names have been changed over the years, Jeremiah 17 and 9. That, but that's a curse, though. That's a curse that's in the scriptures that talks about, that talks about what would happen to us because we disobeyed God's law, right? And so that's the message we are here telling our people, you know, so-called black Hispanics and Native Americans that we God's chosen people versus black. Because here's a controversy right now. We got Kamala Harris, right? We got all these folks trying to vote for her because they say she's black. But in actuality, she's, in, she's Indian and Irish. And there are same folks, right? Just saying, just because she's, I'm just saying, how are you going to go against her? Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm just saying, I voted for the best of two evils, and that's what I did. Right. Trump or him? Right. And I voted for him. Right. I'm just saying. But right. at the same time, because it's, it's, it's really nasty the way that this is cycled, right? Mm-hmm. And of course, you know, we, you know, like when my mother and my grandmother, right, they didn't have, they couldn't vote. Right, exactly. So, to, you know, but it's like, okay, from the streets to right, it's like, okay, I still think this way. But going back that ain't that, messing with me just yet. But going back to that point about about us not knowing who we are and our names being changed, you got that? Read that. Well, no, who got Jeremiah 17? Read that. It's the book of Jeremiah, chapter 17, verse 4. Uh-huh. And thou, even thyself, shalt discontinue from thy heritage. So the Bible said that a certain demographic of people were going to discontinue from their heritage. Now, when you think about, look at the word discontinue, it means we're going to stop, right? And at a certain point in our lives, when we were brought from Africa over here, they beat our heritage, our language, our culture out of us. So it says we will have you our shame, right? Right. Because we were taken from our land. From our land and from and our heritage. Off in certain areas. That's right. Which those people that got dropped off in the different areas are our brothers and sisters. And once again, this has been going on uh-huh. since we began, right? Right. From the Israelites. Right? Yeah. Right. We're going to conquer, uh, right? Right. And then you give some society, but we're going to take it anyway. Right. Just saying. That's why there are many shades of us, right? Right. We're all around it. Finish that scripture. So, so it said that we would discontinue from our heritage. Read. And thou even thyself shalt discontinue from thine heritage uh-huh. that I gave thee. Right. And I will cause thee to serve thine enemy. To serve who? To serve thine enemy. Uh huh. In the land which thou knowest not. And that's exactly what you see. We're serving our enemies in the land that we had, we had no idea where we were going. You even got people that tell you. That talk about the basketball and the football players when they, they kneel for the national anthem. Well, go back to your where you came from. Well, you brought us. Such as an infantry. Right? We were taken. We were taken. As infants. That's right. right. We're going to take what we want. Right. And we, you will serve this king. That's right. The scriptures, talk about, the scriptures talk about a nation from far away was going to come and get us. That, that wouldn't show any mercy to the young yeah. nor to the old. And when you think back to slavery, our forefathers, they would have you in the, in the field as young as three and four years old, picking whatever there was. <laughs> they didn't care about if you if you had arthritis. They didn't care about if the women were on their menstrual. They didn't care about none of it. There was no mercy, right? And these are sun up and sun down. And these are, these are curses that are on the children of Israel. So a lot of people today, when they think of uh, God's chosen people, they think it's the people over in the, in the land of Israel, Israel that wear the black hats and the stringy curls coming down. But when you look at the different curses um, that signify who the children of Israel are, they don't fit those people. They only fit us. It doesn't fit. From the words, it does not fit. Right, exactly. I'm just saying, because I would no, always true. ask my mother as a young child, I'm like, what happened to teen Jesus, mom? Uh-huh. Just saying, <laughs> he was born, and then he was this age. Uh-huh. What happened? Because if he was the following this man, this individual, right? Right. From the time of his birth, then there has to be tears. Right. Where is it? Like Jesus never got mad and got picked on. 
He did get mad. He got mad, yeah. He utilized his powers. What what happened? Yeah, he you just so said. There was a period of time where he was basically like doing a lot of learning. Yeah. He was up under the, you know, the the, 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 uh, the elders. So, yeah, that's a good, that's actually a good point that he made because he's saying that where is the scriptures about his teen life is your question? Right. Yes. Go to Luke 4 about you know how how he was brought up. Right, right, right. Luke oh, Luke four, 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 sixteen. He, he four, had right. he had people that he takes a village yeah, to raise one. That is the universe. Right. Right. Mm-hmm. 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 Right. 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 He was about his mother's business. Yeah, he got that scripture too. He got that scripture too. Because I want to address that. Read Luke 4 16. So this is kind of in reference to that, that, that transitional period between when he was young and when he reached a certain age. And he came to Nazareth where he had been brought up. Where he had been brought up. And that's his customs was. And this was his customs. So this is what he was doing in that transitional period between the youth and the adulthood. This is what his custom was, Reed. My whole everything, except the words, the words. Right, right. I've been through it. And this is that confirmation. All kinds of I'm just saying, I feel more people. Right. But let him finish that point, though, showing that he, he had a teen life. He was brought up in the custom. And he came to Nazareth where he had been brought up. Uh-huh. And his custom was... He went into the synagogue on the Sabbath day and stood up for to read. That's the point. That's just the point right here. Right. So that was what his that was what he was he was used to doing. That was his custom was to go in there and then when he reached a certain age and he reached a certain level level of knowledge, now he's out there teaching. He's being that example, that that perfect example actually, that that we're supposed to follow. You know. So that, that was a great question though. Such is. I think for a fool, next six, answer. That's what he said. Mm-hmm. 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 Grow up young inside yeah. the club. Club. Yeah. club. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, 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 Wait a minute. Yeah. I just saw something well, that well, really well, hurts my well, heart. And I wanted well, to stop. Well, okay, I'm going to tell you. Got off the bus. Until I get back to work, that's that true money that I can tell you. Right? Check it out the glass. Which way? This saying 15 seconds this way, 15 seconds that way could mess your whole day up. Right. Not really mess it up, but it's a pain. Right. I'm like, okay, I know where I want to go. Where do I need to go? Right. So I went on this way, came back through, right? And I saw the Spanish couple. It was just a guy and a girl. She was holding this bag. Right, now I'm on the bike, and I'm paying attention to traffic, you know what I'm saying, because I've been hit before, that's what left me all this hardware in my right foot. But I see him do it, and I don't know if he hit her or smacked her, but she jogged over like this, right, and just with this, right, and he's still on the phone. So I kept bailing him, I stopped, and I'm looking back, and I'm like, Tony, what, right, like, what would Jesus do? Just saying, when they say stay in your lane, wait a minute. And then two cops come through, right? And I look, and so I flagged him down, like, you might want to check on him. Just saying, but that hurt my heart because of that shit not have happened. Right. I mean, literally. You said something, you said, what would Jesus do, right? Well, so we understand that when Jesus walked to earth, he did he wasn't walking with Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. He wasn't walk, walking with those books. Don't stand what he out did have body. though is he had the Old Testament. He had the Torah. He had the law. Because that's how he operated. So in regards to that, because you were at odds like trying to Shalom. figure out, dang, what am I mm-hmm. gonna do? That's what should I do? Deuteronomy 19 and 17. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Right. I stopped myself doing what I Really. Oh, I get what, what you're saying. Do, right. I'm just saying, I'm like, uh-huh. wait a minute, because I There's know the true nature of that? what transpired. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All I saw was him do that, right? I don't know if he hit her or maybe a mean mother. The scripture that says, don't stand right? idly by uh-huh. as your neighbor. Yeah, you know, but still, you don't put his hand just saying. Right. 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 Just saying. I believe. Somebody, two by four breakers, you know, but right. she just still was holding it in his back. Right. right? She took that whole lick that he gave her. Right? Oh, 16. Thou shalt not stand against him. And he's still on the floor. 16, 16 is the one. Thou shalt not stand out of the lie as the blood. That's what I want. Yeah. 19, 16? 16, yeah. Three, three, 
So this is how, how because you had a thought to do something, right? Well, read that. You want to Leviticus. 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 Why am I talking about Deuteronomy? He got it. He got it, right? You got it? Yeah, I got it. Talk, read it. Read it. It's the book of Leviticus, chapter 19, verse 16. So this is how you deal with certain things like that, read. Thou shalt not go up and down as a talebearer uh -huh. among thy people. Right. Neither shalt thou like, neither shalt thou stand against the blood of thy neighbor. Right. I am the most high. So you're not supposed to stand against the blood of your neighbor, meaning you can't sit there and watch your brother or your sister go through it with somebody, get beat up, get jumped, and just pull your phone out and film it, which is today's. That is ridiculously retarded. Right. You're supposed I'm to help your brother. Right. But like, wait a minute. I can put myself in either diffuseness or maybe that energy will come straight to me. Yeah. Either way, it was still my choice and this ain't right. Right. So like the, right. George, the George Floyd situation, all those people stood there and, did, and didn't intervene. But that would have been the righteous thing to do. Even if it wasn't cops, you, and the scriptures talk about, talk about um, there's nothing greater than giving your life for your brother or your sister. Right. So you can't look at that and be like, oh, I might die if I do this. No, let me go and intervene so I can protect my brother or my sister. Everything happens the way it's supposed to happen in the right? Don't worry about that. That's like going into a fire to save somebody, right? 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 It doesn't matter. Right. We are not thinking. Actually, we are. Our synapses are firing correctly. Right. We're supposed. We are supposed to. We were put here to help each other. Exactly. Literally. Exactly. No matter how many shades we are, we're supposed to help help each other. And that's 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 the. Who the hell just walk by like this or walk over somebody? Like, and that's a law that we're supposed to help our brothers and our sisters. We're supposed to be there.